Hi, best friends. It's Kathy with Kathy's Garden. I love making everything that has to do with junk journals. And if this is something you enjoy too, please subscribe. Speaking of subscribers, I have a thousand subscriber giveaway. Shout out to I I Olives I I, Trisha Trisha Joyce. Ricky, Jean, Joyce, and Christine, I appreciate each and every one of you. Today, guys, we're going to take um, a look at the um, Artie Mays book page circle embellishments. Now, okay, that's what she calls it. Well, we're not going to use book pages. We're going to do Kathy's take on that. Um, so what I did first was I got some... Uh, mm, file folder and I coffee dyed it so it's got this very interesting coloration I used my circle punch you don't if you don't have a circle punch like you could use the top of this and just draw this uh, on your page and cut it out by hand with your scissors if you don't have one of these this is a clear punch clear cut punch we are trademark doesn't have a size or anything but anyway I cut out some circles and what I did first was I got my black ink well actually no that's not what I first did first I took my uh, let me get it over here I got my I can't even think of what this is. My ink. <laughs> and I just went around the outside on both sides. Okay. Then I got my milled lavender. And I just put a little bit of pink here and there. Not a lot. Just a little bit. Just to give it some interest. Yeah. Just like that. Just to give it a little bit of interest. Very, very pretty. Alrighty, let me set this aside because I'm not going to need this again for this project. Alright, so the next thing I did is I got my black ink. Get everything out of the way. And I got my little stamp that has the words on it and it's from Stamp Abilities. And I just inked one of the corners and I lightly put the stamp on the circle so that the words come out. Very nice. Very, very nice. Just like that. Beautiful, right? Beautiful, just right like that is beautiful. The next thing I did, I'm gonna have to wipe this up just a little bit, just for a second is I got <clears throat> one of my napkins. This is the way this napkin looks, like this. So I went and I cut some of these pretty little flowers out. And I ended up with little pieces of flowers like this. These little fellas. That's what I ended up with. So, I thought that uh, this one is definitely quite beautiful. And I really like this one as well. I thought that is gorgeous. So, I'd like to put that on my circles. So, I'm just going to use my matte gel. And I am going to go ahead and just put a little bit right here, just enough so I can get my napkin on there. I think I want it just like that. Put a little here because I didn't have any right there. And I'm just using a little bit because I'm gonna need to dry this while I put you guys on pause. So just make sure you get all the edges just like that. Oh my gosh, you guys, 
I love it already, don't you? And let's do the purple one as well. So the weather is still very cold, but it's not raining anymore. So, um, and we got the horse trough for the horses. Um, the, the new extension plug worked well, and it got the heater unfroze the horse tank. So we went and we decided that we should let the horses out. And oh my gosh, they are so cute when they first, the first when they get out after they've been cooped up for a little while. Oh my gosh, they hop, they skip, they run, they jump. They are so happy. And they're so fun to watch. It just makes you smile mm, to watch them be so happy. All right. Isn't that, that's beautiful. Just beautiful. So we have these two, just like that. So now I'm going to dry those very quickly. And I will be right back. All right. I got them fairly dry. They're not perfect, but they will... They will be dry enough for what we're needing to do to them. So I'm just going to cut the edge off around the, the circle where the napkin sticks out just a little bit. There we go. Now, what I would like to do is put a, let me get it here, a, a punch, a hole. I'm going to put a hole right here. There we go, and I'd like to do another one on the other one. There we go. Now, I'm going to get a, what are these things called? Y'all are screaming the word at me. I can't think of what they're called. We're going to get one of these doohickeys here, and we're going to put it on here. There we go. Oh, I just love these things, whatever they're called. And <laughs> I don't remember what they're called, guys. It's okay, right? <laughs> Somebody's going to tell me what they're called. I'll remember before, the, well, maybe not before the video's over, but I'll remember. <laughs> All right. So then I made up these little mm, Mm, doodahs. <laughs> I can't even think of any words. Okay, so I made this purple one. I thought that would look pretty with that one. And this one's peach, even though it gets with the peach and it looks kind of pink. Or we could put the shorter one with it. We could do a long one and a short one. Then let's go ahead. I'm over here grabbing these light bulb. There, I've got enough. Alrighty. I'm going to grab this and we're going to put this on here like this. Now that's not the last thing we're going to do. Let me get the other one on here. If I was not on a video, I would have done this before I did what I just did. But since we're on a video, it's going to be this way. I have to do it this way because after I do this, I really can't move them. I'm going to get my glossy accents. And I'm going to see if it's, yeah, it's coming down. Wipe that up now. Sometimes it doesn't come down right away. Let's stick a pin in it. And I am going to put those that glossy accent on the napkin of the image in which I cut out. Guys, I think it just makes it pop in such a beautiful way. Truly, I do. Get that on there like that. Isn't that beautiful? It makes the color just come out more, makes it pop. Uh, and it just makes it have dimension. 
and it just sets it off. It just really does. It's the added touch that these beautiful charms need. So this is Kathy's version of Artie May's what she call them again? She called them Artie Made Book Page Circle Embellishments. Yep, this is Kathy's version of the circle embellishments. And they're very easy. No, Kathy doesn't do anything too awful. Complicated. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, you guys. Now here, I finished this one earlier. I wanted you to see how beautiful this turns out with the glossy accents on the flower part and then when you when it's all dry um, you can no oh, goodness gracious here we go when it's all dry it just looks absolutely beautiful i am so glad you joined me and i'll see you in my next video bye guys